Another favorable matchup, and no artillery. Let's go. I'm gonna play the one line, eight nine line, pretty campy. I'm gonna head over to this kind of position. I'm gonna try and cross. I have a turbo on this tank. I run uh, turbo in the boosted in the mobility slot for medium tanks, um, vents, and uh, gun rammer. Uh, I'm really been enjoying this tank. I put this is actually the only tier 10 I have two marks on. It'd be pretty cool to get that third star. Don't think it's gonna happen anytime soon though. But you never know. I definitely want to get to a point where I can say I'm gonna three mark a tier 10. Uh, it would be really really cool, especially this is my first tier 10 in the game. Uh, I really enjoy it. It'd be really cool to do that, but I'm not there yet. So I'm not gonna try right now. I'm gonna get frustrated. I'm just gonna play the tank, do well, and you never know. I might get a third mark. This uh, 3D style for it, though, oh, it's it's one of the best 3D styles. And this, all this here, helps to cover conceal, not cover conceal, the weak point. So it, uh, I don't know how effective it is, but I definitely think it helps. It makes it hard for people to target that weak point. And that's a good thing. That's always a good thing for a tank like this, which does does kind of struggle at times. It's not. I would say it's a middle of the road, 210 medium. It's not one of the worst by far. It's not one of the best though, by far. Uh, the best one, obviously, the 907 is the best. STP is also really good. Um, let's see. Yeah, those are the two big ones. 430U is okay now. It's kind of uh, forgiving new player tank, but as far as like the best, it's it's you know it's it's okay. That's how I describe it. Somehow I have not been spotted, which allows me that. Oh, the E75. No, oh, but this uh, T-54 is seriously helping us out. I put a shell into him. Oh, that was a lucky shell. Oh, yes. And we're losing the base. We're losing the base. We're losing a whole team, actually. The whole map. I'm going to go back to base, though. I feel like that's where I'm needed the most. Because we literally have no one over in that direction to help. If I can kind of get back to here, I'll be able to farm. Then as they come in, and the M48 has got the DPM, it's got the gun, it's got like, I think it's the best version, in my opinion, of the standard uh, 105mm NATO gun. The Leopard has a 420 Alpha version where it's more accurate, but it doesn't have that same rate of fire, and I love the rate of fire, so. Uh, IS-5. It's not a tank save today. The aim time on this tank, it's okay. Um, the M60 has a better gun. So I'd actually say the M60 is my favorite gun of all of them. Because literally, this tank, but slightly better. In every respect. So it's just a little more accurate. Oh, it's an unfortunate shell. So many annoying things happening right now. And we're just lo I don't even know what, like, what can I do to help. Like, what? How can I win a match like this? Is this over just like this? Not by missing like that. If this Yagru fires, I can put a shell into him. Or if he... Oh, uh, that was stupid. That was not smart. Do not do as I did right there. Put a shell into him. I want to play up top again. We are seemingly, at least seemingly winning that top side. Ooh, that was close. That would've been really annoying. I'm just gonna look, okay, E75. He bounces, this tank has good turret armor. If they don't hit your mantlet and are firing high pen heat, they will bounce. Um, that is very nice. So we can actually still win this now. Um, they're pushing through and winning, and we're holding. At least somewhat holding this flank. So, looking for the 5A, he was over here last. It's gotta kinda play more passive. We'll look for the E75 again. Hmm. 
All right, this is what I need to do to help win. I need to kill this 5A. And I can do that if he's playing up there. <sighs> Sometimes I miss the V-stab. Sometimes I miss that V-stab. T-44 on base. Are you kidding me? Ugh. Okay. Play it cool. Put another there. That one hit. The 5A is moving up. We can... We can destroy him. We can absolutely destroy a 5A. Every single day. Yegs pulling up. I can't fight a Yegru. He fired though, so I can kinda go up on the slope. Oh, E75 in the open, okay. He's a priority target. Can I put another shell into the 5A? Track, but I kinda shot in. I'm gonna look at this Udez on the other on the other flank, see if I can put a shell into him. I track him. Does not seem to have a repair kit though. Put one into him. Can I reload in time? Can I get the kill? Someone else got a kill. The Yegru is doing things though. He fired. I'm gonna push up. I'm gonna just push in. I need to track him again. He uses repair kit. He's another repair kit. Track him again. Oh, this is tasty. This is a, this is this is awesome. Okay, put another one. Oh man, he repair. He's a fast repair speed. It's all good though. It's all good. Oh, I set on fire. Ooh, he's burning. Nice. And the CS is gonna go and die. I did not fire a single gold round in this game also. That's always nice. I love the APCR on these mediums. This was an amazing game. I did f almost 5k damage there though. That's that's a kind that having more games of this level is how uh, you're gonna put a third star on a barrel. So it's pretty awesome. This tank, the M48 Patton, I love it. One of my favorite tier 10 tanks. Did I actually get any kill? Alright, this is uh, 3 artillery on Malinovka. I'm not playing the hill. They don't have very many heavies, but uh, I'm not playing the hill under that kind of barrage, so. Uh, just gonna kinda, I think, play it pretty chill at the start, see how the game develops, and then just try and play the patient game. Although this patient game is going to include... Okay, never mind. Yeah, I was spotted. Of course I was. Swerve that way. I don't want to get shy. Got a little bit of spotting there. Uh, oh, wow. They're pushing up aggressively across. Huh. What is going to be the result of this? I might actually go join. Actually. Huh. If their attention is devoted, I could potentially play aggressive over this way. Let's see. They are definitely pushing up aggressively, though. Really unfortunate that I got spotted there. Really don't want to get spotted there. I'll put a shot in. I'm not a light tank. I'll hope out in the death process. I'll kill him. Nice. Now I want to pull out because they have three artillery. That's what you do. One. One fired. Okay. I'll just chill here for the moment, actually. That guy made a mistake. So he was playing this bush, but his rear was sticking out. Which meant that at this angle, I could see the back of his tank. If he was all the way in the bush, I probably... Oh, wow. That made my screen shake. Probably can't do it. LT. kind of want to go here. I'm doing it. The M48 is pushing up on the CS-63. 
He's gonna die to that. Oh, whoa, actually, no, okay. Okay, nice CX3 action. Okay. Now I'll just go here, spot these guys, counter these guys, look for shots here. I can basically just kind of sit here and do all kinds of cool things. That. Ooh, nice. A nice bounce there from a big name TD. Put a shot into the artillery. Hopefully that guy dies. Making this kind of aggressive play is risky. There is no doubt about that. But I'm getting so much spotting now. It paid off this time. It paid off in a big way. I didn't even take a single hit of damage for that. There's a T30 still back here though. But you can see my turret's holding up. Uh, my turret's holding up pretty well. As it should. It's a oh, nice big damage. Oof. If this guy dies, I won't get proxied anymore. Nice. I love my big, uh, big aggressive medium attack plays. I need to be careful. What I'm gonna do? Oh, let's see, 63 died in the south. I'm going to. They only have a few tanks left. I'm gonna slip down along here instead of cresting. Track that guy. Get big spotting. I am getting so much spotting here. Actually, it's crazy. Nice. Nice. <laughs> this is an easy game. How much damage have I done? Not enough damage, though. Another kill. This is just too easy. Oh, this guy's in an annoying tank. Oh, can I get a top gun, though? Can I get a top gun? I am thinking yes. Yes to the top gun. There's an artillery piece that was a one shot for my earlier attacks. He's probably back here. Somewhere back in here in this corner. Along with the T-54. Get him, my top gun. Okay. Can I get this guy's well? No. Okay. 6,000 spotting. That is a new record for spotting damage I have done. That is awesome. Damage is really low though. But 